Hey y'all, welcome back or welcome if you're new. My name is Kimmy. I live in a single wide mobile home in North Carolina and today we are doing a home reset. I'm going to attempt to clean the entire house today and um, let me just show you what it looks like because it's bad. Yeah, we're going to tackle all this laundry on the porch. That's actually the first thing I'm going to clean. I already cleaned the porch, but I'm just going to wipe down my little coffee table out there. And then I'm going to wipe down my cushions. And then I'm taking all of this and we're folding it outside because I love being outside. So if you need something to clean or fold like laundry and sitting outside motivates you, fold outside. Why not? The kitchen is not terrible, but it's messy still. And there's lots of dishes to put away and a crock pot to clean. I want to get this tackled today. Also, in the next video, I'm going to do a extreme declutter with me because my clutter is starting to overwhelm me. Even the decor that I have out is starting to overwhelm me. So, we can do something. These are all clean. I washed them yesterday. But like I want I want this to be like almost a makeover where it's it looks so different than what it looks like now than it feels like a before and after. So that's why I'm showing you all the befores. I need to change sheets on the bed. I want to take this down. I don't know if I'm going to do that in today's video or save it for the declutter video. But that little bat thing right there and all the pumpkins on the top. I feel like it's just too much in one area since I already have a garland up there. Um, I just want to minimize things. I want to minimize this. Like all these perfumes. I don't. We don't even use them all. <laughs> Some of them are mine, some of them are Aaron's. We don't use them all. It's a mess. Laundry on the floor. Folded clothes here because we don't have room to put them away. My goodness. Oh my gosh. This is our bathroom. It's your mesh. Okay. Messy. 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 But that's what clean with me's are for. If I cleaned a clean house, it wouldn't be very motivating in my opinion. So we're cleaning a messy house today. <laughs> okay, this room is not terrible. It's my office, but it's really dusty in here because the cat litter boxes are in here. Y'all don't even want to know why that wall is blue right now. My cat really decided to just play on the wall. Okay, if you know what I mean stuff got on the wall and I scrubbed it so much that the paint came off so that's why those things are not touching the wall anymore I woke up to a nightmare um, normally you, you wake up because of a nightmare I woke up and then had a nightmare okay anyways this is messy no <laughs> messy there's a goal notebook with I put dashes for every hundred dollars I make. <laughs> it's okay. So I don't want to show you all that. Um, and then this, this too. Like, stop. Who lives here? I feel like a college student. No offense. But I just feel like so messy. Yeah. Um, we don't have to talk about it, do we? So that's enough chatting. <laughs> I'm going to go outside and wipe down those cushions so that we can fold our clothes and they'll stay clean. By the way, if you like realistic, lived in, clean with me's, um, if you like home decorating and home refresh, like updates, makeover, videos, gardening, things like that, just all around homemaking content, hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you. It's free and um, you will see all the glorious videos I upload. <laughs> okay. You know I'm being silly, right? Okay, I hope y'all figured that out. Even if this is your first time being here, I'm not serious. Sometimes. Sometimes. But most of the time not.
you try Do you know I'm looking And I can't help but smile Do you know how much I love you You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling Just loving this moment Can we stay here
All right, y'all, I've got the laundry folded. There's still a lot of laundry in my chair because it's all the things that have to be hung up in the closet. And while I'm doing that, I'll probably go ahead and declutter my closet because there may be, I feel like there's things in there. I haven't even taken the tags off yet. But before I do that, <laughs> I'm looking at Erin. Um, I'm going to go ahead and change the sheets on the bed and clean the bedroom because I really don't want to be putting up clothes and hanging up clothes in a messy bedroom. So that's my method today. Okay, so I actually am going to go ahead and tone this area down. I am going to wash that comforter um, and these sheets and then I'm just going to put the old, the one that matches these sheets back on the bed and go ahead and take this stuff down here. I just kind of, okay, so what happened is I thought I was going to go all out for Halloween and fall, which I did. Um, and we're about three weeks in, I guess, to since I decorated, if my timing is right. And I'm just starting to feel like, oh, this is too much. <laughs> and I feel like less really is more. So 
it's not that I'm not going to use these things ever, but I don't have to use them just because I have them. I can always, you know, if one year I don't use something, I can use it the next year. That way I'm not just, you know, it looks like I just threw up Halloween or fall. <laughs> Um, and it will look cleaner too. So, yeah, I think sometimes, sometimes too much kind of takes away versus having those few pieces that you focus on. So that's what we're going to do. Also, I cannot find my, what do you call it? You use it to get the hair off. Lint roller. I use it for hair. So I'm always like, what's a hair roller? <laughs> Anyway, my lint roller, so hopefully I can find my lint roller while we're cleaning up in here. But I'm going to go ahead and get the bedding taken off and then put the new bedding on.
searching for something that ain't lost Have we got our lines crossed? We're wasting time on stuff that doesn't really matter While wishing for something better So I like the look when people fold the sheet underneath the base, but I do not sleep with my feet. I don't like that. I don't like how I either have to have the blankets and sheet kind of cupped underneath my feet, um, like tuck, tucked in, I guess. I don't know. Or... I will take my legs out completely so when I have the sheet in here like this it makes it really hard for me to pull it out you know with my feet at night so what I'm gonna do is actually just take the sheet itself and fold it in like that that way it's not going down there but it makes it easy at night for me to either put my feet under it like this where my feet are kind of in there like a sock or take my feet out completely so that's what i'm gonna do i just figured i would let y'all know because a lot of times when i make the bed people will tell me i make the bed wrong and it's just a preference it's just how i like to sleep and if i tuck it in um like the base then it messes with how i like to sleep so that's why i'm doing that but i am going to make it look a lot nicer than it looks right this second because it looks raunchy the second even though I, the clean sheets First time I saw you, I was so nervous to talk. Happened so fast, 
Went from so lonely to falling asleep in your arms. I used to be afraid to fall in love. My past relationship was a disaster, but now I don't care. Cause you took my scars, bruises, and broke. These pillows were so hairy, I finally found my lint roller, but funny enough, it only had one piece of paper left on it. <laughs> so, um, there may be a few stray hairs left on these pillows. Alright, I love this. It's so simple, but I still feel like, oh, that's Halloween. Um, less is more. <laughs> I still have this up here, which doesn't really match with this, but um, I like it. I like it. It does match with this right here, with all these pieces like that. So I'll let that stay. And then the little pink on the ears matches my lamps, matches that little picture over there. So this works. I think this looks way better than what it did before. It looks kind of bare from what it was before, but it looks clean. So I'm gonna take a little break, but the next thing I'm gonna do is just pick up all the mess in here, wipe down my end tables, and get this stuff up over here as well. So we can uh, go through our closet and uh, put all of our stuff back in the closet that goes there.
Alright, bedroom is clean, the floor's clean, everything's off, bathroom is cleaned up as well, and now I gotta cook dinner. 
I baked these all by myself. Just kidding. We're having pot pies. I've got turkey. And, um, I think the other one is chicken. Yeah, chicken. So this is dinner. I need to make sure they're all in here. I think that's how we, we burn our eyes, stuff dripping. But those are gonna cook for about 30 minutes. I'm gonna take another little small break. I'm gonna make macaroni and cheese and mashed potatoes as well because what I like to do is put the mashed potatoes down and then put the pot pie on top of it. The gravy mixed with mashed potatoes is so good. Um, and Erin's been wanting to try the Cheetos flavored macaroni and cheese, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, do that as well. But I like to take breaks throughout the day. That way the task doesn't feel so daunting. And I typically get more done when I do that because I'm not basing off, basing what I can do off the energy I have in the moment. I take a little break and then when I'm done with my break, I have energy to do stuff uh, further. So that's what we're going to do. Since this takes about 30 minutes to cook and it only takes about 10 minutes to do mac and cheese and mashed potatoes, I've got 20 minutes that I can max out of sitting on my porch. It feels so good outside today, so I have to take advantage. Mac and cheese is going. These just came out of the oven. I normally upload daily and I haven't decided yet what I'm going to do permanently. So I'll let y'all know what the schedule is probably after this week. I'm just giving this a little trial run, but I'm going to upload uh, this video Saturday. The next video is going to be Tuesday and then the next video after that is going to be Thursday. And then if that goes well, we'll just continue that. But if not, we'll probably go back to every day, except for Sunday. Um, but <laughs> right now, I'm about to clean the kitchen. I um, am wanting to make my videos better and also prioritize the length because the, okay, when I did this backsplash, that video was an hour and a half and it did really, really well. So um, that tells me that y'all like those longer videos and especially for cleaning videos y'all are going to be able to get so much done and be able to clean along with me because the video is so long um but making them still good you know because a long video is great but if it's not good what's the point of it being so long so anyways i'm gonna get started cleaning up the kitchen and then i'm probably gonna be done i'll show y'all dinner but I'll probably be done. Excuse me. This is Chloe's food. The door opened. That's why we leave that door there, by the way. Um, when I get done, I'll pick up where I left off tomorrow, which is uh, Saturday for me. Um, oh, shoot. This is supposed to go up Saturday. Okay, yeah. I'm going to continue filming tomorrow and get it posted <laughs> tomorrow night. <laughs> I'm so silly. Anyways, don't leave though because it's going to be a part of this video. I still have three rooms. Well, actually four because I forgot about the bathroom. Four rooms left to do. We're just now in the kitchen. The world around could pass us by A thunderstorm, a lightning strike As we hold each other tight You're the rose in a garden
All right, y'all, dinner is done. There's the mac and cheese, mashed potatoes, and pot pies. My food always looks so nasty. <laughs> Sometimes I fear when y'all say, I made your recipe. <laughs> but you cannot tell me that a chicken pot pie, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese does not taste good because it does.
Gotta let the sun shine in the day I'm trying to make this darkness go away I'll paint with colors And I'll sing until my lungs give out mm -hmm. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day And I will leave my windows open So that I can hear the sound of
Hey y'all, it is the next day and I'm using my Caldrea sea salt spray on this picture frame with the pictures in it of family that was in our old shed and as you can see it's got some damage and I made a horrible mistake. Um, I was trying to make two of the images clearer and it actually took all of the I guess ink off of the photo. Uh, and it ruined it but look how dirty this is gross um but i did get the picture frame and the picture looking so much nicer and i have decided to display it on my shelf in my office that has all those cubbies in there can try if you let me with our lives i am bleeding who am i without stories that aren't mine what i did to achieve you gave me air thought i had to i'm untrue it's not pretty the truth hurts you stayed on the ground while I was high. Yes, you
expect you to leave I deserve to be unheard But I want you to see That you are the reason why I try I don't know what you're thinking But I know how you're feeling I have crushed and burned someone before And now I'm afraid of the person I'm pretending to be But I'm more afraid to tell you I'm less than you see And I know when I let go right now I'm gonna turn you against me Cause baby My two cats like to sit on this table, but as you can see, it gets absolutely disgusting. And the only thing it's holding is a box of computer paper and a VCR. So honestly, whenever we get a larger shed, um, I can put thing like the VCR in there if I want to. And then I can get rid of this table. So eventually this table is going to be going out of this room because... I don't like to clean it <laughs> and it doesn't really serve much of a purpose they have other windows they can look outside of to your heartache if you want to open your door mm. i'm feeling kind of lost when your mind is so everything in this room was dusty and nasty because this is the room with the litter box oh my gosh my air conditioner just kicked on anyways i'm gonna be quiet in just a second because that sounds atrocious paper towels do a better job than a microfiber cloth when you have this amount of dust. There you go, I said it. See it in your eyes that you're shaking cause you're holding 
I got this picture in my closet. It's gathering dust right now. And the edges have been folded once or twice. It doesn't look the same no more. Cause the sun has made it pale. I used to have it hanging on my wall some time ago. A picture of you. You're standing by that window, playing your guitar. And if I close my eyes, I can almost hear your song. A picture of you. of you I could talk to you for hours and we stay up all night and when morning came we make breakfast in bed I don't know why I threw away the word we had what's wrong with me I don't know why I threw The look you had upon your face when I said goodbye. First time I ever saw you, I fell in love when you entered the room. At your face We were just kids But I knew right away That I will be with you Until I stop breathing I will keep loving you As long as my heart's beating Oh, we close Promise you
My air conditioner is still on, but I am taking off these chair covers because they collect so much hair from the cats, and it's a lot easier to clean if it is the leather that is underneath the cover. So I'm just going to wash these and store them away in case I want to use them in the future.
as long as we had each other oh, everything was black and white when we were younger Hey, I try my best to talk to you Tell you about the things I like to do I know your smile is lighting up the room Up the room Do you always look this beautiful? Can I kiss you when the night is through? Because right now it's all I wanna do, wanna do Lipstick Left a mark on my cheek So I keep thinking of you Tell me what you want to do I'll do anything you ask me to As long as I can spend the day with you Day with you Lipstick Left a mark on my cheek So I keep thinking Of you Alright y'all, we did it. We decluttered a lot. Um, I was going to make a decluttering video, but we did declutter a lot. The only room I really need to declutter now is the laundry room, so I'll just throw that in the next video I film. 
um living room bedroom to me is well honestly the kitchen too big difference i always have had a bunch of clutter over there um, near the deep freezer on the floor and now it's all gone uh, i've got a lot of laundry to do now just from all the rooms i was picking up in i would see like dirty socks t-shirt pants just from where i don't know if y'all do this but we don't always change in the same spot <laughs> um i don't know why but like especially if i'm just we don't have kids so like we could just i could take my clothes off anywhere and change my clothes um as long as there's not like a window or a door in the way so a lot of times i'll have clothes in the hallway of all places because i'll pick up my clothes that i want to wear off the couch because that's where the clean laundry normally is um and i'll go in the hallway and change <laughs> and i'll just leave my dirty clothes in the floor anyways but now that we've gotten it as clean as i can get it um we're not doing that anymore i will i mean it's fine if i leave them in the floor but literally either that day or the next day all of that stuff needs to be gotten up there needs to be no more of me just walking past it and forgetting that it, or uh ignoring that it's there because i'm not forgetting it's there i see it anyway this is how our house used to be clean um when i first started my channel because all i would do is cleaning videos like every other day <laughs> but um so i need to find a balance where um, i'm not filming cleaning videos every other day but also keeping the house clean regardless of if i'm filming it or not uh, but i'm so happy with how it turned out this video was super long so i hope you got a lot of motivation out of it i want to reupholster these chairs a lot of people say to get rid of them um but they are such good chairs i don't know why some people say that but these are really good chairs like i don't know how i how i would be able to replace these you know and they're like vintage and everything i like the pink um and it goes with my little pink cake over there but there's not a lot of pink in this these rooms other than a door which i'm gonna be painting uh black um and i'm I don't think I have any storm cloud left, so I don't know if I'm going to paint that, that storm cloud blue or not, like the living room, but it would tie the living room in with the kitchen and more of the countertop, so I might paint this one light that color blue like the countertop is, and then keep the door black, that way it kind of balances out everything. That way, my base, like surfaces and all of that are pretty much neutral, because this has a lot of gray in it it's a storm cloud gray by sherwin williams um that way when i decorate for the seasons it's not it's not so like in your face like everywhere if if that makes sense like the walls being different colors plus the decor it's like a lot of going a lot of things going on so instead just have everything kind of a neutral that way when i do decorate with my color which i love to decorate with color um it's not so busy and it's stress-free and uh, not overwhelming because that's how it was getting to feel like um but i'm probably gonna reupholster these those are my shoes <laughs> um black so have black and then the gold and the little wood accent i think that would look really good um and it would it would go better that's the same reason why i switched those out with the red ones because i was like there's no red in here other than what's in the living room and that red isn't very bold it's kind of muted or moody and plus it's kind of tucked away in there so it creates a shadow so it's not like in your face um i do really like this orange pop right here that orange pumpkin was on my bed but like i said at the beginning the bed was just a little a little much for me now that i'm over here I'm seeing my little gallery wall and every time I see this I'm like oh I can't wait to fill it up some more with some because there's like spaces where I feel like another picture could be there so that's something I'll do um, but the cushions being off I think it looks really good and it's still bright I think when you have good lighting you can really do whatever you want with the furniture and your walls um, a lot of times that's 
that's what makes a room look dark is the lighting so we use daylight bulbs um but they're they're not the fluorescent -y ones they're i think they're called soft something like that so it's more of like a a natural white versus that bluish tone white but anyway here it is i've got <laughs> that's also long. i mean it's a huge pile over there i'm gonna be doing laundry for days getting all that done because all the cushion all the covers and all the old sheets everything has to be washed and then put away in storage so fun time i will see y'all back here what is today saturday i will see y'all back here uh tuesday for another long video and i don't even know what we're gonna do <laughs> i kind of want to do a little bit of not updates well i might so we have black spray paint which Aaron thinks would be fine on the door. So instead of going out and buying jars of black paint, I'm going to attempt to use the spray paint and see if that, that uh, covers it, covers the pink. And if it does, uh, we could do that in the next video and do like small little updates, I guess, not even updates, kind of just like a little projects around the house. Things I wanna, I've got a shelf I can put up in my, office that's like the one in my bedroom that really long shelf and then i also have a pitch a, a mirror with a wood frame around it that i can put somewhere and then that wooden where did i put it i put it in my office um it's an old timey like peg but it, i don't know if it has the pegs it might just have like a little shelf aaron built it we found it in the shed and it has the little heart cutouts so I want to put that somewhere as well. I don't know where I'm going to put it yet. I might, I don't know. I like, I like that shelf, but I might take that off and put it there. Not sure yet, but we'll, we'll find somewhere to put it where it looks good. But anyways, that's it for today's video. Subscribe, especially if you made it this far, you're a trooper. And oh, let me show you a quote of the day and then I'll let you go. Shut my feelings out. You look at me like I'm different. Still, you stay because you feel something real. Get so lost in my moments. Doesn't mean I don't need you. I, 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 I fell in love with your colors. All right, I showed y'all a few of them because I'm not going to be here for a couple of days, but. Um, I will see y'all on Tuesday. I hope you have a great Sunday and Monday. Get some rest in if you can. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.